through. Um, was there anyone in your life that inspired you, that um, gave you the encouragement you needed and was the example uh, that you felt um, you needed at that time that stood out from maybe other people that you've known? Well, as far as the ministry goes, there's been quite a few different people that's inspired me to go on. One of the m most was a, uh, a man who I didn't know that well. Um, I'd been around him a little bit. His name was uh, Pastor Galbraith. Uh, he was, when I was just in 20, 21 years old, he was in his 80s. And uh, I'd been at a pastor's retreat and uh, he'd come and he'd had to have both of his legs uh, amputated and he'd lost his eyesight and I don't know how many other health problems that he had in his later years of life. In his younger years, in his, up through his 60s, he'd been quite healthy. But uh, I remember waking up one morning in the dorm and looking over and he had both his little stubs up in the air and he was working his legs and he was just singing and praising the Lord and thanking God for a brand new day and um, he like I said uh, you start to talk to him and he'd ask who it was because he couldn't see anymore and he was always just so positive about serving God despite how bad his circumstances got and like I said I didn't know him very well but it, it just stuck in me, so deep in me, uh, thinking, well, you know, if he could praise the Lord in his situation, then I didn't have anything to complain about. And um, so it was, it was very inspiring to me. And then there's been other uh, older ministers who are basically just about all gone now uh, and are with the Lord. And um, it was the same thing that they had been quite healthy. There some were evangelists, some were pastors, some were teachers. And of course as the body gets older things would go wrong. But I saw in all of them this this steadfastness. And it's almost like they knew they were getting at the end of their journey <laughs> and they were happy about it. I mean they were just they were just uh, they were ready to meet God and uh, they had such a peace. So those are the kind of people that's always inspired me. You know, even as a little kid, I remember sitting with my father in a bar downtown. Uh, all the fishermen would be in there 